Hello viewers, welcome to Planning P6. Hope you are doing well. Today we are here with a special topic, which is we received a comment uh, from uh, one of our friends, student, who want to learn about how he can change the scaling on left and right side of the activity usage profile. So we will describe that how we can change and manage the activity usage profile before I prepare the lecture on it but I want to explore more how we can manage it. So let's move forward and open your Primavera P6 here. Here the project is already opened and we will directly go to the activity usage profile which is here the source this one activity usage profile open it after the opening here is the option my friends want to change this values and this values actually the question was that his total commutative was 7000 hours and here showing the 12000 hours actually there is the option it will be divided the all values to in five sections whatever your cumulative value is here you can see and then here if you see here the line is going like that here let's change the line color here to see very clearly line color if we do at red okay apply i think now you can see here the line color it will be divided because your color your values are here are what are the bytes and these are the cumulative for that section so how we can change we cannot change it must be divided into the five sections one two three four five we cannot change but if we change their in percentage and reduce them values and see very clearly how we can change it so here here is first of all the option is that we will go to the time scale and change the time scale if there is a time scale you want to say for the week per day week day per hour month per week or quarter per week you can change whenever whatever you want apply here you can see it's now comes like that move back so in this section you can see here and here if we go to the activity usage profile option here is a cost we will go to the units if you want to see the cost select cost if you want to see the units then you can see the unit supply here now we migrated to the hours so these are the hours for this period which we assigned there it is for the months months total units are thousand and if we see here go and then select here in the time scale per day if we select here per day week day one apply and okay the maximum units are for the some activities are this one and up to cumulative are there this these are budgeted individuals and these are cumulative and how we can manage it we can manage it we have to option to see as uh, activity select for the selected activity some activities you can select and you can see for the activity individual as well and here you have the option to see as a time period which time period are day you select here the duration it will be show here and if you double click here on the same one you can see here this table will be day of the thursday november 5 this budget units how much cumulative is how much and actual labor units and remaining labor units are how much then you can see by this vision as well by whatever you want to see you double click on it it will show here as well bar and here and here you can see the total units and remaining units as well so the other thing is that how we can manage these ones if it is flat or something you can change how we can change it so here in the activity usage profile there is option if you remove the if you select the baseline apply apply baseline also show here the color with this color you can see here okay and if you want to expand this one you can do like that and these are the baseline now you can see it is cumulating this one 
and this one is our cumulative further your project and it must be divided into the five sections it is a default by primavera p6 you cannot divide into four or change the values from here yes you can change one thing activity user profile go to the graph section in the graph section you can see here here you can put the average of that one then these values and these values will be decrease calculate average you can say you want to overall average divided by two and unit of measure is percentage okay after the apply you can see here now it's divided by two your cumulative values are divided by two but it is still in five sections in five numbers if you want to divide it by three you can also divide it by three here now we, this one also you can say what are the number you can see in the numbers as well you can write whatever is description is there so one option is that to see the decrease values okay now it's on his original condition you can change it but the second option is that you go here and if you want to don't want to see these values cumulative just remove and curve will also remove with that cumulative values these curves these curves are going this will also remove you can see here now our cumulative values were gone and only the budgeted values are there if you select the cumulative then it this value will be show here apply the cumulative scams and curves are also come if you don't want to see some budgeted values do you cannot you can change but the budgeted values if you remove the all of them then these values were gone out and you have the options on only two for this and curve will remain same and the bars will go out if you select this one the cur curves and bars will be remain and your budget were there this is how we can manage if you see the non labor and cost you can change from here and the other option is that how we can see if you are confused to print out that how we can print go to the print option and here you can see here the print option page setup if you want to see the only curve here go to the option and only profile you can print on a one page okay you can see here your profile is here and uh, fit to time scale fit to one apply and okay now you can see here your time scale is also fitted and for header we want to manage the header and uh, text logo modify okay apply now you can see here only the your profile is here nothing is else you can print on one page whatever paper size is you can print and see the values easily this is how we can manage the primavera p6 profile activity usage profile option and you have the option to print as a pdf or any other printer you can print it out hopefully this concept is clear now if there is any other confusion let me know please like share and comment on our tutorials thanks for watching allah hafiz